How's it going guys, it's The Analyzer, and today I'm gonna to be making a tutorial on how to record internal audio from any Android or Apple device. Now first, there are a few things you will need to record the system audio of these devices. The first thing you'll obviously need is an Android or Apple device. You will also need a male to male 3.5 millimeter AV cord, and you'll need the audio software Audacity, which is free for download online. Once you have all of these components, you are ready to start recording system audio. So to start off, you'll be taking one end of your AV cord and you'll be plugging it into the headphone jack of your Android device, like so. Or if you have an Apple device, such as this, you'll be plugging it into the jack of your Apple device. Now you'll be taking the other side of your AV cord and plugging it into the back of your computer in the digital audio import area, like so. Once everything's connected, we're going to hop into Audacity and we'll show you the settings there for it. Once you have Audacity open, you're going to make sure all the proper settings are checked like so, with Core Audio being the first one. You want your built-in input selected, stereo recording for stereo sound rather than mono, and you're going to select built-in output for the playback. Once all your settings look like this, you're going to go up to Tracks, Add New, Stereo Track. You may not have been able to see that. And once your phone is connected to your computer, as we did before, you're going to hit the Record button. And right now I've got a game loaded up. I've got Marvel Contest of Champions here. I'm going to turn the volume up a little bit. And as you can see, it is recording system audio from the Android device. Now I'm gonna go ahead and select a little bit. Let's just do a quick battle so you guys can hear how everything sounds with the quality that is. So everything sounds great. It's in line with the game. Sound is everything when you're recording for games. Um, it just it adds to the quality of the recording if you have good sound. So once you're finished recording, obviously just press the stop button. And you'll see that your track here has been recorded. Now we're going to mix it down. You're going to go up to File, Export Audio. And if you want it as an MP3, select MP3 files. Um, you can type your name here, your file name. Go ahead and click save. Click OK. And it'll start mixing it down um, and exporting the file. And it's going to be in the directory application folder where you can find Audacity. Um, this is where all the recordings are manually, or automatically rather. You can change it manually if you'd like um, by browsing folders and whatnot when you export it. 
once the file has been exported. You can navigate to find it here. We're going to play it for you guys. Everything sounds great. And at that point, you can add it to video software and uh, sync it up to the video that you recorded. So I hope this cleared up everything for you guys. Um, obviously, there's many other ways to record internal audio, such as rooting your phone or your device. Um, if you want to keep your warranty, obviously that's not an option um, unless you unroot it, but it gets a little more difficult there. But yeah, if you want an easy way to go ahead and record internal audio without rooting your phone, this is the perfect way. Um, might be a little tedious, you know, just setting it up, but once you get it all set up and you know you keep doing it, you'll get used to it and it's really simple. So well thanks for watching guys and for the next videos to come, please subscribe. And if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Leave any comments below if you have any questions. And if there's any other tutorials you guys would like for me to make, just leave them in the comments as well and I'll be happy to make them for you guys. Thanks for watching again and we'll see you in the next video.